Trey Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Welcome to our EA Sports Showdown here tonight. International Showdown here tonight. Does the environment change when you're playing nationally as opposed to a club? 100% it does because it's a little bit different. You're not usually with regular teammates, so everything feels a little bit different, but you are playing for your country. Teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Unleashes a cannon. Comes up with the stop. Getzel's got it across the line. There's a shot. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. And he was slowed up, hooking looks to be the call as the official's arm goes up in the air. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Shot! Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Oh, it just trickles over the goal line. The goaltender stopped most of it, just not all of it. Got the game's first goal just past the midway mark of the first. What's the mindset now here? They were just talking on the bench. Let's go get another. I like it. You're up one. Be aggressive. Go push the other team against the wall. This has been a heck of a shift for them. They've got them hemmed into the offensive zone. Now they can carry the puck around as the defenders are just going to play a tight box. They look exhausted. And he slides it quickly to McDonough. Scores! Oh, the game back to level now. Anybody that's had a lead, the lead is gone, and now we're evened up again. Oh, he tried to flash the leather there. I guess he flashed it. He just didn't catch anything but a cold. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can Feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And that one's picked off. Moves it to Kessel. There's the physical side. Comes up with the stop. If you're going to leave a rebound, it might as well be 30 feet away from the net. That's a really good stop because the puck's out of danger. As the first period comes to an end, this one's still a dead heat. 1-1 is where we sit. Hey kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team, you'll have the opportunity to have a couple of our players sign autographs after the game. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period. Handles the puck. McDavid's carrying it ahead. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. He scores! Well, they break the tie here, James. This game had been hotly contested since it's been level. They now have found a way to jump into the lead. He's playing the percentages. Drops into the butterfly, but it doesn't help him. He gets beat pretty cleanly. Team Canada's given themselves control of this game now with a one-goal lead in the second. They'd like to get another before they go in for the second intermission. You'd love at least a couple-goal lead going into period three. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Matthews setting up against the wall. Kessel's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Moves it quickly over to Gensel. And the officials will pass the sentence here. Huberto's getting two for tripping. Reaches in with his stick and gets nabbed for the trip. Scooped up along the wall by Eichel. Looks to set up along the point. And that's off the iron! 
USA is only looking for something to go right, get themselves back in this contest. But this hits the goalpost, and the score remains unchanged. The play starting to break down in front of them. Jones lowers the boom. That's a big hit. Here in the late goings of the period, it's a 2-1 game. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. That was a great shot, but an even better save. Stick saved by the goaltender. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. It's a two-on-one. Let's it go. He scores! Well, I like the way they stayed aggressive here, James. After scoring once, they didn't just settle the game down. They went after it again. The defenseman's lucky they don't have freeze frame here. He'd take a look at himself and say, what am I doing here? He's so far from the slot. And then the puck gets shot in the net. Team Canada's goal here late in the second has to take a ton of wind out of the sails from their opposition here. I don't see how it couldn't. You're only one down, you feel pretty good about yourself. Now you're down two. It's a pretty tough spot to be. Turns it aside. Latang's lugging the puck. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. And that's all she wrote on period number two in this one. 3-1 is where things stand as both teams take a breather heading into the third. Hey fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team signed poster, which will give away before the end of tonight's game. Third period is just around the corner, so don't even... Think about putting that controller down. <laughs> and we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. 40 minutes into this one here, Razor, how do you see things? Team USA's players have to be feeling a little frustrated. They've had much of the time of possession, but they're still chasing the game. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Suter's going to play it against the half wall. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Works it across to Tavares. Breakaway. Oh, what a stop. Uh, excellent stop here. He makes the save in a close game. You will always remember a big save at a big moment. Spectacular. Oh, that's a good look from the guys in the truck there. Look how he lines them up, times it perfectly, and throws his shoulder right through them. Great positioning in the defensive end. Big hit. And someone's going off here as the ref's hand goes high in the air. McDonough's got the puck. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Oh, what a save in front. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. Points getting called for tripping. He's going to look up at the big board and see that. Yeah, you know what? That's a trip for sure. He got a stick in the wrong spot. Tripped up the player. Quick pass to Kane. Takes the shot. And a great save. Weber's moving the puck through his own zone. Tosses it on to Stamkos. And there's the insurance marker much needed for them on this night. It's amazing how many times a guy misses an empty net, but this one he puts between the pipes. Oh, now you got a couple of goal lead here with the empty netter. That should be enough to put this away. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Takes the pass. Makes the save. That's probably not what they were planning on the pop. Beats the goalie, but can't beat the post. Scores! Jack Eichel!
Well, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Team USA has had more shots on goal, but yet they've run into a hot goalie. And they trail late in this third period. Team USA goal. And we are all over with this one tonight. Well, how big does that shorthanded goal look now after this one? Well, you don't expect to score one, really, and you certainly don't expect to give up one. And when that becomes part of the difference, that's a tough one to swallow for the losing team. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.